Hello, and thank you for choosing Revive Node. Today, I'll be explaining how to upload a plugin to your server. Of course, you can do that via our plugins page, but we're going to have a separate video completely for that. But in this case, what we really recommend you doing is always downloading your plugins directly from the page to make sure you have the most compatible version for your server. First of all, what you should always do is stop your server and we'll head over to File Manager. And if you already have a plugin compatible jar installed, such as Spigot or what we recommend Paper, you should have a plugins folder. If you don't have it, you can come into versions and here you can install Spigot or Paper. For newer versions, we highly recommend Paper. Of course, Perper works as well. But going back into the file manager, we'll go into our plugins folder. And here, since it's a new server, it is completely empty. What we can do is download our very first plugin. And for this case, we will be downloading via version. It's a simple plugin that just allows you to join from different versions, but I will not be wasting you on the details of the plugin. I'll just be explaining how to download it and upload it. Since it's a free plugin, I can just quickly download it. It will save it over to my computer and we can go into file manager and just drag and drop the plugin into the folder once it's completely downloaded on our end. Let it process and that's all it takes. We can start up our server and as you can see here via version has been detected and we can even do PL and it will show that it is green and activated within our server. If the plugin is not activated, we highly recommend you contacting the developer as sadly we did not develop or create any of the plugins that are on Spigot or MC Market or any other resource page. So sadly, we will not be able to fix the plugin for you, but just contact the developer and they should be able to assist you as soon as possible. But if it is green, you're good to go. Other than that, feel free to use the plugin, but that will be it for this tutorial. If you guys would like to see any other tutorials, please let us know in our comment section. Other than that, we hope you guys have an amazing day and thank you for using Revive Node.